June, State Senator Frank Artiles has resigned, consumed by a scandal over using a racial slur and vulgar insults. Protesters have called for the Miami lawmaker's resignation for days now. CBS 4's Ted Scouten is live in downtown Miami with a reaction to today's big news out of our state capital in Tallahassee. Ted? Yeah, Elliot, for days now, as you were saying, there have been calls from all over the place for him to step down from the Florida State Senate. We were here at the Government Center for what was supposed to be another call for his reg resignation from Miami-Dade women in leadership. Instead, it turned into a celebration. Oh, my God! Celebrating as word comes down that State Senator Frank Artiles has resigned after using racist and sexist words. He's accused of using those vulgarities in front of fellow senators Audrey Gibson and Perry Thurston in Tallahassee on Monday. I'm grateful, I'm thankful. Uh, he knew what to do. Dr. Dorothy Benders Mendingall is a current Miami Dade school board member and former state legislator and roommate of Senator Audrey Gibson. She's thrilled to hear he's stepping aside. In a letter, Artiles said, I am responsible, I am accountable, and effective immediately. Immediately, I am resigning from the Florida State Senate. It's clear there are consequences to every action, and in this area, I will need time for personal reflection and growth. Senator Dwight Bullard held the seat before and was calling for him to leave. I'm glad uh, that he has uh, stepped forward, uh, done the responsible thing, and decided to resign. So the question now, what will happen next? Uh, from what we understand, it's up to the governor, uh, likely within the next 60 days, to call for a special election. But uh, here's one of the real downsides in all this. Uh, district 40, the district that he represents, will have no representation in the Florida Senate for the rest of the legislative session. We'll have much more on this coming up later on today. Live in downtown Miami, Ted Scout, CBS 4 News.